Good day folks, Sean here from Air Photography. So in today's video, we're going to be doing a comparison of the Hero 11 Black against the new DJI Osmo Action 4. In fact, I'm actually filming this on the Osmo Action 4. It's a pretty incredible camera. Now this isn't a full feature comparison. Basically, we're going to be comparing the stabilization, the video quality, the low light capabilities, and the audio quality. I do have another video that I'm working on that's going to go more in depth into the different features and perhaps which camera is the right choice for you. That'll be uploaded in the next few days. Now I'm not going to force my opinion on you. After all, opinions are that, just opinions. I'll let you just watch the footage. I'm not going to do any talking. You could decide for yourself what you like better. But there are a few things I do want you to look for. There's a shot that's included that was after sunset, so it's fairly low light. And initially the GoPro footage looks a little bit better. It's a little brighter, but when you actually look at it, there is a ton of noise. It just looks like there's millions of mosquitoes floating around. Whereas the Action 4 is a little darker, but it's more natural and it actually looks really good. It's footage that is actually usable. The other thing to pay attention to is the stabilization when I'm walking in low light. Most of these action cameras, as soon as you get into a low light scenario, the stabilization and the video quality just falls right apart but the Action 4 actually does a pretty good job and you'll see that in the comparison coming up. Now both cameras are set to the exact same settings. I'm recording at 5.3K on the GoPro Hero 11 Black and 4K on the Action 4. In most of the shots, we're using a wide field of view and the stabilization on both cameras is just the standard stabilization. When you're done watching the video, I would love to hear from you down in the comments. Let me know what you think looks best and anything that you noticed in the footage. So with all that said, let's just go ahead and we'll run the footage now.
So here is an audio comparison of the two cameras, the Osmo Action 4 and the GoPro here 11 Black. I'm going to play one clip with audio from one of the cameras and then I'm going to play it back again with audio from the other camera and that way you can decide what you think sounds best. There's also a fair significant breeze today so we'll see if that makes a factor and how well the wind cancelling works. Again this is an audio test of the Hero 11 Black versus the DJI Osmo Action 4. So here is an audio comparison of the two cameras, the Osmo Action 4 and the GoPro Hero 11 Black. I'm going to play one clip with audio from one of the cameras, and then I'm going to play it back again with audio from the other camera. And that way you can decide what you think sounds best. There's also a fair significant breeze today, so we'll see if that makes a factor in how well the wind cancelling works. Again, this is an audio test of the Hero 11 Black versus the DJI Osmo Action 4. Well, there you have it, folks. There is a video quality comparison, stabilization comparison, audio comparison, and of course, low light comparison. Again, let me know down in the comments what you think looks best and if you noticed anything interesting. Your opinion is very valuable to me. Hopefully you enjoyed this video and got some value out of it. We have lots of Action 4 videos coming over the coming weeks. Thanks a lot for watching and we'll see you in the next one.